Hey guys, it's Michaela with It's a Bond's Life and today I am starting my new series of summer recipes. So this is episode one of my summer recipes. And when I think of summer, I always think of corn on the cob. So usually I would use fresh corn, but I happened to be at Walmart and they didn't have any fresh corn that looked good. So I just did frozen corn. So this isn't the coconut milk that I usually get, but this is all they had. You're also going to need some garlic, some red pepper flakes, salt, pepper, and some seasoning salt. So let's get started in making this dish. Put your corn on the cob in the crock pot and we're gonna pour our coconut milk right on top. Once your coconut milk is on top, we are going to add our seasonings. A little bit of red pepper flakes. So you're gonna need at least half teaspoon to a teaspoon of salt. Probably gonna need about a half teaspoon of pepper. Probably about a half teaspoon of seasoning salt. And then probably about a half teaspoon of garlic powder, not garlic salt. So now you're going to add about four to five tablespoons of butter on top, and you're going to add one cup of water. So after your seasonings are all in, go ahead and add your one cup of water. And I'm gonna do my best to stir this around. So now what you are going to do, put your lid on, and you're going to cook this on high for two hours. So because my corn is frozen, I might give it two and a half hours. I don't know, just check it and eyeball it. And I will see you guys when this is done. So this is what it looks like when it is done and I'll show you a finished plate. All right, y'all, so this is what the corn on the cob looks like. You can add butter, but honestly, it doesn't even need it. It is so delicious. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in our next video.